Hi everybody, Scott Cart here with another quick video on using AutoCAD. Today I'd like to talk to you about how to fill or create a wall in a 3D object. Okay, welcome back everybody. Uh, so let me start off by explaining what the shell man used to do. So uh, what it used to do is to create uh, a constant wall thickness on a 3D object. And this was very useful for when we made uh, boxes that could be 3D printed or possibly uh, even injection molded. We'd want this consistent wall thickness throughout. Now, uh, a couple of years ago, they changed over to uh, have the shell command actually create a shell in the operating system. So it's, uh, it's it used, it used to be hidden in there and it was something that, that we could choose and it was a very useful tool. Um, but now, now we have to find a new way to do it. And so the command that we now use is called, uh, solid edit. Okay. And solid editing, uh, allows us a lot of commands. Okay. And the first one that we want to choose or the one that we want to choose today is body. Okay. And so from body, we were given some options, what we want to do. And specifically what we're trying to do today is to create a shell. Okay. And the next thing is that we want to choose the object. And now we can remove any faces. So for example, if uh, this receptacle that I'm making here, I wanted to remove this face, we could, and then I'll press enter and we can choose a distance to offset and I'll just pick some random distance here. It's not really important, but you can see that it's created this, this consistent wall thickness throughout the whole part and that it's removed uh, this, this portion here. So that face that I removed has cut it away. And so let me real quick create a, a slice. And you can see that what we've created is this beautiful uh, 3D uh, object that is hollow in the middle, has a consistent wall thickness everywhere, and uh, has removed that one face. And so fantastic tool. Uh, I'm not sure why they decided to, to modify it the way they did, but uh, that's it. That's it. So uh, solid edit. All right. Hopefully this was helpful. If it was, please give the video a thumbs up. A do like and subscribe if you'd like to be made aware when I create new videos. And as always, thanks and have yourself a great day. All right. Bye now.